Yo, what's good, everybody? It's me, Fix Versus here. About to give a quick, quick commentary on how my episode one became what it was. It all started January of this year. One day on YouTube, just searching for stuff, searching for stuff like music, like I always do. That's how I start off my videos. I search for music that I like. So I came across a song called Brand X Music, All or Nothing. And I said this song is pretty, pretty nice. So checked it out, listened to it probably over a hundred times in that one day. And I said I'm gonna make a um, make a trailer for it, and then make an episode after it, cause I wanted my episode to come out 4:25:11, which it was gonna be my one year anniversary on YouTube, cause I've been on YouTube since 4:25:2010. So. Started getting clips. Got around like 50 clips before the before the end of February, and I made a. I was already working on a trailer for it, and I got like 60% done. And I showed like three of my friends, and they said, "Yeah, it was good." So I was I was pretty happy. I'm on time. I'm on schedule. And um, one day I was cleaning up my room, and I unplugged everything, the PBR, the external hard drive where all my clips was on. And I was taking everything back up and I put my PBR adapter into my external hard drive. And I put my external hard drive adapter into my PBR. And you know you wanna know what happened? You wanna know what happened? It broke my PBR and it broke my external hard drive where my clips was at. So I called the um external hard drive company and they say yeah they'll fix it but I no guarantee that they uh, restore everything I was like shit they should, re should be able to restore because there's only clips on there there's nothing else on there it shouldn't be that hard and they only broke because of that stupid doctor and I couldn't call Hop Hog because they was closed I called them the following day and they said we can't we can't fix something that's broke from eBay unless we got proof of purchase I was like okay okay so I called my brother because I gave him no money to buy it. And he said he can't find it because he brought a lot of stuff on eBay. He can't find it. So a week later, he still can't find it. I was like, oh my goodness. Two weeks fast with no PBR, no clips. And the third week came. I, I, like, I called him again. I was like, man, you need to check and see if you got that. See, can you find the proof of purchase? So he finally found it. So I sent him my PBR. And the uh, following day, I got my external hard drive back. And my clips was on that. I was like, yes, I got my clips back. I can finish working on my trailer. And um, one day at school, no, no, it, that didn't happen first. Uh, yeah, a week later, the fourth week, it took a month. So I finally got my PBR back. Uh, and then start recording again. But one day at school in my audio class, we was working on a project and I freaking deleted all my clips. I was like, really? Really? Like, I didn't notice until I got home. I didn't notice at school. I noticed when I got home from school and I couldn't finish editing the trailer. And I lost all my clips. And I was like, forget it. I'm done. I'm not doing it no more. Forget it. I'm just going to record and just do whatever. Do whatever. So one day on YouTube... I came across a video that had the Brand X music in it. I'm like, wow. I supposed to have been the first person that used that Brand X song, man. I was supposed to have been the first one. So I came across this, the um, video. I was like, man, this is good. They make me want to do my trailer and my episode one all over again. So I got started on that. Got me some more clips. Got me some more clips. And uh, I made the trailer for it. You can check it out on my channel. It's not even a good trailer. Because I rushed it. And the clip wasn't even good because I just wanted to come out with a trailer so bad. But I, I didn't use that song. I used a different song. And I was going to use the Brand X Music trailer song for my episode and not for the trailer. Like I did at first. And the trailer wasn't good. It wasn't good. So I decided to record and get some clips but I only got like two clips because I had a laptop my laptop is garbage completely garbage and 
I got tired of recording on that stupid thing. It only had two gigabytes of RAM, a Celeron processor with one core at 2.2 gigahertz. I was like, I can't take it no more. I can't take it no more. I need to get a desktop computer that's faster. So I said, I'm gonna buy me a thousand dollar Dell. And I told my brother about it. He said, a Dell? Who you gonna buy a Dell for? You can make a custom make, custom make, I mean, custom make your computer. I was like, where? He told me the website. So I went to the website, got my joint custom made for 1300 with a i7 processor and a 8 gigabytes of RAM. So that's when I, I got it around, no, I got it June 4th. And I started recording, got my clips, and started working on my episode 1. Oh, I had to re download all them programs again. I started uh, working on my episode 1 in mid June and came out mid July. Yeah, so I've been working on it for a month because it's my first time ever using Sony Vegas because on my laptop, my computer wasn't fast enough to um, run Sony Vegas. I had to use a program called Carrera Video Studio. So uh, that's really my first time ever using Sony Vegas and Adobe After Effects and Twix and Optical Flares and Twixter. So you gotta give me some props for that, man. I really gotta give me some props for that. First time ever using those effects and it come out successful. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Yeah, so I'm already working on my episode two. Got the song. I don't got the clips though. I'm like, I'm gonna work on episode, episode two. I don't got no clips. But yeah, man, it's coming to the end of this, man. This um, if y'all wanna play with me sometime, just add me on Xbox Live. My game tag is Face Versus. So yeah, I will be on today and tomorrow. So y'all can add me, and then we can play together and we can get some clips. So hit me up.